It wasn't supposed to be like this. It's no surprise that Prince William is finding things difficult with all of his extra burdens at the present. Shocking news broke out after Prince William was noticeably absent from the late King Constantine of Greece's memorial service in Windsor. It was truly surprising that the prince backed out, especially without much of an explanation from palace officials. Instead, they simply noted that it was a personal matter without sharing other details. According to what the palace said, William called the late king's family himself to tell them that he wouldn't be able to make it to the memorial and that Catherine continues to be doing well. Mystery continues to shroud Prince William's absence from a high-profile royal event, only fueled the speculation around the royals even more. People have a few theories about what might be going on. It could have something to do with his wife, Prince Catherine. The public remains in the dark about what kind of surgery she had and why she needs so long to recover. The fact is she hasn't been seen at all since her hospitalization, already hasn't been sitting well with royal watchers. As with the little information coming from the news of William's cancellation, you know the prince doesn't make a habit of pulling out of events before. Some are becoming even more concerned. One person tweeted, What's going on with that family? Why is Prince William canceling engagements? He already doesn't do very much. Catherine was in full glam doing photo ops after giving birth, but why can't she be seen for months now? The rare comment was made on Tuesday as Buckingham Palace issued a statement to reveal that Thomas Kingston's sudden death is not the reason for Prince William's absence from his godfather's memorial service day. Mr. Kingston was found dead on Sunday evening at an address in Gloucestershire. An inquest will be held to establish the cause of death, but there are no suspicious circumstances and no other parties involved. Although some people were worried that it could have to do with King Charles's recent cancer diagnosis, it seems that's not the case. Queen Camilla attended on behalf of her husband, King Charles, who was a close friend of the second cousin of Constantine. The pair got on so well together that Charles asked Constantine to be one of William's godfathers upon the prince's birth. No matter what's going on, hopefully everything will be fine behind the scenes. Since the service, Buckingham Palace has announced the death of Mr. Kingston, a financier who wed Lady Gabriella Kingston in May of 2019. The man's family said Mr. Kingston lit up the lives of all who knew him in a poignant tribute tonight. Saddened by the news of Thomas's death, age 45, King Charles and Queen Camilla have sent their heartfelt thoughts and prayers to Lady Gabriella Kingston and Mr. Kingston's family. A statement was released on behalf of Lady Gabriella Kingston, Mr. Martin and Jill Kingston, Mrs. Joanna Connolly, and Miss Emma Murray, read, It is with our deepest sorrow that we announce the death of Thomas Kingston, our beloved husband, son, and brother. Thomas was described by his family as an exceptional man who lit up the lives of all who knew him. The statement continued, His death comes as a great shock to the whole family and we ask that you respect our privacy as we mourn his passing. He was a close friend of Pippa Matthews, the Princess of Wales' sister, and the pair were said to have dated in 2011. Although Lady Gabriella is not a working member of the royal family, she and Mr. Kingston's family are being supported by the royal household through this difficult time. In June 2019, Mr. Kingston made his first-ever appearance at Trooping the Color, an annual parade held in honor of Queen Elizabeth's birthday. He was also a director for Davenport Capital, which specializes in providing finance for companies in frontier economies. The Bristol University graduate had also worked in Baghdad, Iraq, working to procure the release of hostages after joining the Diplomatic Missions Unit of the Foreign Office.